My name is Daniel Bacanio, I'm a response officer. Our main job is responding to the calls that we receive every day in London. I joined the Met in 2021 through the Degree Holder Entry Programme, which is available to those who already hold a degree. It's a two-year course. The first four months of initial training will be taken at uni. This is where you will um, learn legislation, case law, undertake your basic training. You will also spend some time at like Met premises, either doing IT training or personal safety training. So you'd learn how to use handcuffs safely and how to protect yourself and your colleagues and the public. After you've done your initial four months, you would then do two months of street duties, which is like a tutorship led phase with other students. Here, you're actually out and about in uniform in London, policing the street. I was very surprised on my first day, meeting other officers from all sorts of different backgrounds, not ones that you would typically expect has just shown me that not only is London diverse, but its police force is actually very diverse. People from all sorts of different cultures, countries. It brings a lot of different experience into the workplace. People have gone out of their way to talk to me and say that they think what I'm doing is good. They're surprised someone so young is doing it. And then the fact that I'm young and black is another surprise for them. I've been in the job for about a year. I've enjoyed response the most, mainly due to just how varied it is. As cliche as it sounds, every day really is different. One of the things that inspired me would be to help people. As a response officer, when you can actually see something all the way through, people who've broken the law come to justice, the victim themselves being happy or relieved, I do find that quite rewarding. In the Met, they offer a lot of different opportunities to people, whether it's specialising in traffic, counter-terrorism, financial crime, the Marine Unit. There is a role for everyone.